everyone, welcome to Children's Church. My name is Jocelyn, and in today's lesson, we are going to learn about a story or parable that Jesus taught. But first, let's start off with an opening prayer. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Wise God, my goal is to be wise like you. I pray that you fill my mind with knowledge. Apply it to my life so that I make better choices. Help me plan better work with efficiency, and devote myself to tasks that further the kingdom. In Jesus' name I pray, Amen. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Jesus would often use stories to teach the people an important life lesson. In this parable, he compared building a house with how we should build our lives. Jesus painted this picture. Imagine building a house on solid rock. When a storm comes and the rains and wind start blowing hard, the house will stand because the house was built on a good foundation. But if the house was built on sand and the same storm hits, the house will fall because the sand will just be washed away underneath it. If you've ever been to the beach before, you've probably seen how quickly water wipes away your sand castle. Sand is weak, but rock is strong. Stories of the Bible, the parable of the two builders. This is Jesus, hey who is the Son of God and the Savior of the world. While Jesus was on earth, he taught everyone about God's love and healed people from their sickness. He did many miracles like walking on water. Oh, hey guys and even raised people from the dead. Uh, wahoo! One day, as he saw the crowds gathering, Jesus went up to the mountainside and sat down. His disciples gathered around him, and he began to teach them. He asked them, Why do you keep calling me Lord, Lord, when you don't do what I say? Anyone who listens to my teaching and follows it is wise. Hey, I'm gonna build here. Yeah, I'm gonna build out there. All right, suit yourself. Like a person who builds a house on solid rock. Oh, yeah. When the floodwaters rise and break against that house, it stands firm because it was well built. I'll get it here. But anyone who hears my teaching and doesn't obey it is foolish. All right, hey, it's nice. Like a person who builds a house on sand. Uh oh. When the rains and floods come and the winds beat against that house, it will collapse with a mighty crash. When Jesus had finished saying these things, the crowds were amazed at his teaching. So, the life lesson was about having the right foundation. Jesus was saying that he is the rock, and so is his word, the Bible. Building our lives on those things will make us strong. When hard times come, we can survive it because Jesus will give us strength, and the Bible will guide us. But if we put our trust in worldly things like popularity or stuff, our lives will fall apart when hard times come. Remember to build your lives on the rock, which is Jesus and the Bible. I had so much fun with everyone today. See you next time.